Hi there, welcome to Get Fit with Gosha. Today I have a total body strength workout for you using kettlebells. I have two kettlebells, one is 15 pounds and one is 20 pounds. So you need one a little bit lighter and a little bit heavier. We will also do some cardio kickboxing intervals in between to burn fat and to get that heart rate going. And beside that, grab your water, towel, good music, good attitude, and let's get this workout on a road. We're gonna start with a short warm up. Okay, warming up with a kettlebell today. So stand with your feet out and take that kettlebell around the body. And keep your abs in nice and tight. Put a smile on your face. And I'll change direction. Beautiful. Take it all the way around, nice. Give me four more here. Three, two, and one. Bring it back to the center. Bend the knees. Take it into figure eight. Starting from the front, go to the back. That's the way, nice. We are warming up for three minutes. Then we're gonna go straight into our strength training intervals. Okay, now starting from the back. Pass it to the front, figure eight. Going in opposite direction. Nice. Four more. Three, two, and one. Flip the kettlebell. Rub it by the horns. Bring those knees up. And breathe. So for the next 30 minutes, forget about everything you have to do today. Focus on yourself. Knees up, drop the kettlebell, hamstring curls, loosen up those legs, that's it, kick your butt. Eight more, seven, six, five, four, three, two, and one. Flip the kettlebell up, feet together, abs in tight, around the body, around the world, or around the head I should say. 10 in each direction. Come back to the chest, starting position. Five more here. Four, three, two, and one. Bring it back to the chest. Go the other way now for 10, nine, eight, and breathe. Six, five, Four, three, two, one more, beautiful. And a very slow deadlift. This is more of a stretch. And come up, and again down, stay here. Rest the kettlebell a little bit, relax your head. Come up, do it two more times. Down, rest the kettlebell, relax, shake your butt if you want. And up one more time. Just start by shaking. All right, going into first exercise. Goblet squat, hold it here. Down, knee up. Down, knee up. We are here for 50 seconds. Then you get a 10 second recovery in between. Up, slowly. Down, lift the knee up as you come out of a squat. the way. Beautiful. Full range of motion. Going all the way down, all the way up. We're doing two sets of every exercise. Time. Next one is tactical lunge. So you're going to start with one hand, opposite legs going forward. You're going to pass the kettlebell underneath and then change to the other side. Pass underneath. So for, you go from the inside out and pull. Pull up, down and up. Keeping your shoulders back. That's the way. Beautiful. You're doing great. Keep 
going. Ten seconds left. After this, we're going into swings. You can grab your head, your kettlebell. Three, two, one, last. All right, I'm grabbing my head, your kettlebell for the next one. We're doing alternating arm swings. Three, grab the quarter of your kettlebell. Ready, let's go. So, switch it up at the top. Swing, catch. Remember, when you're doing your swings, it's a hip thrust, it's not really a squat. Your toes are pointing straight forward. Up. Thrusting the hips. Switch up at the top. Keep going. After this, we're going into cardio intervals. Cardio kickboxing. Three, two, one. Last. Time. Three intervals, cardio kickboxing. First one, start punches. Feet together, hands together. Move the feet first. Punch it up. 30 seconds here. Lift, down, lift, 
Feeling happy? Yay! This is good pain. Your body's working. Keep pushing it. Keep challenging yourself. Squeeze the butt. Almost there. One more here. Awesome work. Next one is tactical lunge. So I'm going to start with my left hand. Pass it under my right leg. Okay, here we go. Pass it under, pass it back. Pull the kettle a bit up, just to the chest level. Don't have to bring it up too high. And up. 30 seconds here. Keep the shoulders back. 20 seconds, come on. Let's go. Last 10. You're almost there. Drop that back knee down as low as you can. Time. And now we're doing alternating arm swings. Feet together. Grab the corner of the kettlebell. Let's go. Up. Thrusting the hips forward. Squeeze the butt cheeks as you push the hips forward. Abs in tight. Protect the lower back. Also remember not to lean back. Okay? You get yourself out of alignment. Stay here. Knees over the ankles. 15 seconds left. And you're doing awesome. Three, two, one. Left. Time. Now we have star punches. Hands up. Feet together. Three, two, Ready. One. Let's go. Exercise. Seconds here. Come on, speed it up now. Three, two, 15 seconds left. Keep the hands up on the face. Times. Squat and knee strike. We're going to keep the knee strike. Don't worry, we'll do the squat and knees and staff kick later. Hands up. Okay. Down. Snap and knee strike. Woo! My legs are burning. I did a crazy workout yesterday for my legs. So I can really feel it today. That's okay. No pain, no gain. It's good pain. Like I always say. It's all worth it. Hands up. Beautiful. Three, two, one. Last. All right, and last one. Four punches, four snap kicks. No stance here. Both feet together, hands up. Go. One, two, three, four. I want you to do powerful punches. You don't have to go super fast. Focus on the technique. Full range of motion. And you will work all the proper muscles that you need to. Almost done. We are 
down with the legs now. Now we're going to move to the upper body for our kettlebell strength exercises. So have both kettlebells ready. <clears throat> Exercise number one. You are going to do a push-up past the kettlebell under the body. And then we're going to do some shoulder exercises. All right, just follow me. High plank position. One push-up. Pass the kettlebell under the body. Do another push-up. Pull. Down. Keep the butt low. Fifty seconds. Same sequence as before. Fifteen second work. Ten second recovery. Keep your left leg to the front. Three, 
Hands up. Follow me. Hook. I mean, uppercut. Hook. Hook. Uppercut. Repeat. Uppercut. Hook. Hook. Up. Up. Now you're gonna speed it up. Alternating. Up. Hook. Hook. Up. Up. Hook. Hook. Up. Up. Have a little rhythm. Little rhythm flowing here for you. Going at your own pace. So it just becomes pretty much two uppercuts and then two hooks. That's all it is. Not that complicated after all. Keep going. Speed it up. Okay, 30 second recovery. We're gonna repeat this whole sequence one more time. All right, drink, drink some water. We're gonna start with push ups again. I'm grabbing my heavier kettlebell now because so I wanna challenge myself. Three, two, high plank position. All right, let's go. Push up. Pass the kettle down under. Keep the butt low. Everything's aligned. That's the way you're doing great. Time. 
Okay. Squat and snap kick. Hands up. Three, two, Woo. one. Let's go. Exercise five. You can go faster than me here if you want to. Like I said, I did a heavy leg workout yesterday and my legs feel like they weigh a ton. I was doing pistol squats. One leg squat, going all the way down. It was assisted, but still, you can really feel them. Keep going. And time. Okay, now, now we're gonna do the one with the punches. Now bring your right leg to the front to start with the other side. Slowly first. Uppercut, hook, hook, up. Uppercut, hook, hook, up. That's the way. So just hook and uppercut. That's it. Just think two hooks, two uppercuts. Keep going. Hook. Speed it up. That's what happens when you change sides. Your brain just goes, what are you doing? Well, that's good. Gonna challenge the brain too. Come on, powerful punches. Go a bit faster. Inner thigh. 
If this is too much, you can do this exercise without the kettlebell. So essentially, using the kettlebell, you're working your upper body also. Two, one. And time. Mat away. It's cardio kickboxing time again. Three, Woo! Two. Starting with one man. Arms up our head. Go. Bringing the hands to your hips. Big arms. Pull. Pull the toes. 15 seconds left. Come on, finish strong. Three, two, one. Time. Next exercise. Squat and push kick. Hands up.
if you have no lower back pain, you can bring it up. This is a bit too heavy for me to keep my legs up, so I'm just going to keep my legs down and make sure that the kettlebell touches the ground every time. Come on, finish strong! You're almost there. Three, two, one more. Rest. Okay. Now, feet together. So, so the feet together. Three. Rub the kettlebell by the horn. Exercise. Starting on the chest. Woo! Come up. Keep squeezing the feet together. That's also the feet. Push up overhead. Keep going. Now take a few minutes to stretch your body out, cool off, and let me know in the comments below if you would like to see any specific workouts, and I will be more than happy to make a workout just for you, and I will talk to you soon. Adios. Thanks for watching. Subscribe to Get Fit With Bosa.